Welcome to Travel Agent Support's video on branded content sharing. I'm Stephen Talbot and today I have a great tool that um, I think that all of you will thoroughly enjoy that will help you share content that you did not create while still maintaining your brand identity and uh, keeping your brand and your, your face front and center uh, in front of your clients. Now what do I mean by branded content sharing? Well, let's uh, say that you see a uh, an article on travel, uh, USA Travel, for example, and you think that some of your clients might really enjoy reading it. Well, typically you could send them the link, but uh, when they open up the page, they're likely to be inundated with tons of uh, travel ads, and uh, they might be sent anywhere on the web uh, because you know, it's full of links. Um, they're probably going to get to see, let's say, that you show them a, an article about a cruise ship. Well, there's probably going to be an ad from one of the cruise lines, uh, which could uh, essentially take your customer away from you, your client away from you. So this tool that I found um, is great because it allows you to share a link that places an overlay on top of whatever content you're sharing that has your picture on it along with an action item uh, and, and a way to contact you. Uh, and it's very customizable. So I will share with you a link after the video that uh, will give you 20% off of the pro version or there is a free subscription as well uh, that should probably do nicely for most everyone. So why share content with your clients? Well, sharing content with your clients is a great way to keep them thinking about travel. If there's something that really sparks their interest, then hopefully they'll contact you. Now this isn't always the case if it's uh, you know, someone that you don't keep in contact with or someone you haven't spoken to in a while, um, hopefully your loyal clients will know to contact you. <clears throat> the problem with sharing content you didn't create is the fact that you're sending clients to someone else's website, to someone else's blog, which could lead them anywhere. Like I said before, there's quite possibly going to be travel articles or articles from one of the big OTAs out there. Um, and then every time you sell, share someone else's content, they get web traffic, so, you know, which, which is a plus for them, but what are you getting out of the deal? Um, yes, you're sharing content, but you're potentially losing that client to uh, to all the ads and, and who knows where they'll end up. So this tool sort of uh, changes all of that and uh, I've been using it every day for about six months or so. Some solutions that I've tried prior to finding this tool are iframes um, as well as custom PHP scripts. I had a, a coder write me a PHP script from a, a website called Fiverr, which I will actually go into in another video. Uh, but sometimes um, I, frame, I frame the content doesn't render correctly um, and they take too long to set up. So this is an example of what Snip, uh, Snipply is the name of the tool. This is an example of what it does. So at the top you'll see uh, you'll have a website and then all the content and at the bottom you'll see your picture along with a link and, and an action item that you specify which is on top of the website that you're sharing and you can change it from being at the bottom or the top, or the right or the left. Um, it's totally up to you. Um, this is really, really great. You can share these on Facebook, on Twitter, or, or any of the other social media networks. So I'll just go ahead and go into uh, the tool now. So let's say that you want to share an article on USA Today. Let's say you, you see this article that, that says that you're more likely to get a promotion if you take a vacation. And you happen to know the perfect client this is relevant for. Uh, they talk to you about the fact that they've been you know, trying to go for a promotion. And so what a great way to uh, get them to read this and potentially book a trip with you uh, and at the same time getting them a promotion. So you see these share buttons here. That's how you typically would share something uh, and that would send them a link or post a link to this article on Facebook or on Twitter. Uh, but first, I'm going to show you there's a Chrome extension for this tool called Snipply and it's this little blue square in the top right of my screen here. Uh, this is and this is one way to do it. So you would just click this link for wherever you are a place where you want to share something. You just click the, the extension. And as you can see, in the top right, the overlay has already appeared. I can completely customize this. I can change the words. I can change the colors. I can change whether it's at the top or the bottom, the left or the right. I can make it full width of the screen. I can make it partial width of the screen. Um, I can have it be a button, I can have it be a link, um, any way that I want to customize it, I can. Um, and it, this is really great because 
you can share anything that you want online and your information is going to make uh, it's going to stay front and center so that your clients see you and they know to have, come to you to ask any questions so let's go ahead and create this one just change a couple of things here and I'll create it and show you exactly what it looks like couple characters too long. By the way, if you need more room, you can actually make this full width and it will give you more space to, uh, to type. Or to say what you want to say. So just click create and it's as simple as that. There's the code, there's the uh, link that you want to share. And if we pull it up, you'll see, this is exactly how your client would see this. So. I think this is fantastic. Your branding is still there. You can upload whatever picture you want. You've got a call to action. Um, you can make that button, send an email or whatever. That's just one way to do it through the Chrome extension. You can also take your your, uh, your link and plug it into the Sneakly website once you've signed up. And um, you can create it there as well. I'll also go ahead and show you the dashboard. So once you sign up for an account and you've created a few SNPs, you'll be able to come to this dashboard and see all sort of all sorts of uh, metrics and analytics, and see how many clicks you've had, how many you've created, what your conversion rate is. Uh, this integrates with tons of different apps online. You can integrate it into your website, into your blog. You can set it up with your RSS feeds. Um, there's just tons of stuff that you can do. Even in the free version, um, you're just limited in the free version to 1,000 uh, 1, uh, views um, in a month's period of time. So if you think that you'll get more than 1,000 clicks in a month, you may need to upgrade. And if you are an agency that will see high volume like that, then if you'll look below in the comments, I have included a coupon code as well as a link. If you sign up with that link and use that coupon code, you will receive 20% off for the life of your account. Um, and like I said, there's also a free version. Um, and you can access the free version by uh, following the link below as well. I hope this was helpful. Um, this is just a tool that I've been using for a while that I really like, and I just wanted to get it out there and share it with you guys. So please, if you have any questions, let me know, and I will see you next time.